All right, everybody, I promise this is my last Solio update for now, at least. So I wanted you to know what's going on with the project as it's an ongoing, rather long-term project as far as these tech projects go for me. Um, I have now three devices. I have the H1000, I have the Solio with the tri-charge uh, three-wing trifold, if you want to call it that, and then I have another one that is a little different, and I want to talk about the differences between the two trifold. Now, if you can see on the video, which is a little bit difficult, this one has a slightly embellished crystal structure, like right there. You can see how they kind of counteract each other um, inside the actual crystals. There's more shine to them. There's a little bit different of a uh, structure to the actual charger. This one is flat. This reminds me of what kind of a charge uh, surface you would see on a calculator. And the difference between these two is pretty incredible. Now, they're both the Solio Classic, but they're obviously different versions of the Solio Classic. If you're going to buy the Solio Classic, and if there's a way that you can find out, I cannot repeat this enough, do not get the flat version. Don't get the version that looks like it came off of a calculator that looks like that get the one with the multi kind of uh, faceted uh, crystal inside the panel that looks like that the differences are pretty major between these two the multifaceted I'm gonna call it the mostly multifaceted crystal trifold one it's better built it's more durable it charges faster and it seems as if it's less finicky to get the charge to start you can leave it out without having to direct it perfectly up at the sky into the sun and it starts pretty well it's 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 comparable to this one this one's pretty easy to get a charge to start this one charges quick this one i'm very happy with that it's very very good um this original one which was my first one this flat kind of uh calculator uh it's not a crystal i don't know what's in these things uh but the solar panel itself that's inside of it it doesn't charge as well it's slower the the body is flimsy it feels almost as if when I fold it up that there's space left between them. And if I put it into like, I've been putting these into a camera case, like a little camera case, it's kind of snug. It feels as if it presses them together and I've been kind of worried that for this one, which is the lighter, less efficient uh, panel version, um, that something's gonna happen to it. Now, I'm gonna update uh, what I have to say about this one which is the better version by saying, I had it on the, uh, the door at work today, outside, on a suction cup, and I hadn't wetted down the suction cup as well as I should have, and I hadn't pressed it in as well, and it fell off the door. Um, it fell off and it banged really hard on a brick uh, 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 walkway from about six feet up, and it didn't hardly even get a scratch on it. I mean, it still works fine, it's gone up a click and charge already, so it still works. It's charged my phone back, so it still works. Um, and really the only thing I can see that even happened to it at all is a very, very, very minor scuff mark. Um, it, it's even hard to find, but I don't know if you can see it, but it is right on the tip, right there. You see that little line, that hairline? That's all that happened to it. It doesn't affect the body at all, and it doesn't seem as if it's going to spread, and it could be completely cosmetic. So we'll see. There's a little thing, but it's nothing major. So this one feels a lot more sturdy. So if you have a ability, if you're looking at these things, if you're not just doing it online, which you probably are, and you can see what they look like, get the one with the crystals that look like that. All right? Um, as a general update, I haven't charged my cell phone into the wall in two and a half weeks. Uh, this has been working great. With the three devices, which this one you can see only charges up to four, so this one is full. This one, which is the slightly flimsier one, goes up to five, and it's full. <laughs> and my H1000, which is a little harder to get to click. I know it's a little bit more rugged. There it goes. This one is full as well. So I have three full devices. Now with this I could charge six cell phones or four iPods or you know 
quite a few different devices. So I can get my Bluetooth charged tonight, which I'm going to do. It's almost dead. I'm going to charge up my cell phone from zero to full charge. That's really it. My iPod's at full charge already, and I have all this extra stuff. So anyway, in sum uh, just to summarize all of this, it's working really well. The system is working great. I can leave them up on the deck. I can rotate which ones are lower and leave them up on the deck while I'm at work. I can take one of them, which I don't want to take more than one, with me to work on a day if it's really low because I have uh, a direct east-facing sun during the morning, and I can charge in the morning and then take it home with me and then put it up on the deck where I get west-facing uh, facing sun in the afternoon. So it works out pretty well that way. So anyway, that's how it's working. Get If you're going to get the classic, the one with this kind of crystal structure in the panel, do not get the other one. You will not like the other one. I was really not satisfied with this one, and it's it's a little this one with the flat thing on it. I don't know. Uh, it's is you can see it. It's kind of wobbly. It doesn't feel sturdy. This one, which is the good one, is solid, and it works better. So anyway, there you are. Um, otherwise, the magnesium, which I don't have and I haven't tried, and then there's the uh, this laptop charger that Solio is working on, which should be a pretty cool idea. Otherwise, I know that there is the uh, Solar Gorilla, uh, which I haven't tried yet, which I have my eye on, but we'll see. Anyway, all right, solar update. Hope you enjoyed, and uh, green power. Yay. All right, bye.